Hello, this is Andre Farnell of BetterBodyExpert.com. And I'm going to be talking to you today about the exercises that help us stand and transfer. I'll be working from both the elderly individual as well as the person who is the assistant. So you'll get exercises that'll help in both positions. So much musculature that's very important for the elderly is the musculature of the back and the spine. So what we wanna do is to be able to get that person to be able to sit up on their own. And in order to do so, I like to do what's called sitting back and then rocking all the way up, strengthening the core and the obliques. So using a nice and sturdy piece of equipment such as a body bar or a cane, you can take that person from a slouch position to a stand, performing this in sets of 10 repetitions. From down in a seated position to up, strengthening the core, the back, and the abs. Second exercise would be to place the bar in front of them or closely in front of them, allowing them to do a modified squat. And that is just to get up from one position to a standing position. This will be able to aid that person in standing. So it's strengthening the quadriceps, the midsection, and utilizing this bar or the sturdy um, cane, in some cases, will give them the ability to go from a seated to a standing position, which is very important when transferring from surface to, from one sitting surface to another. One thing to note is that the seat height is very important. So place them in seat heights that are higher than 90 degrees in their knees. So they'll be able to transfer easy, easily. This way, their bottom is not lower than their knee height and it's easier to transfer. So to practice standing with assistance would be very beneficial for the elderly. So there were two exercises that are excellent for a caregiver or an assistant to master when moving an elderly person from one surface to the other. And those two exercises are the good morning as well as a pivotal lunge. We'll start with the good morning. You'll take a weighted bar, place it on the back of your shoulders, and leaning forward as far as you can go, and stand it back up. This strengthens the muscles of the lower back, stretches the hamstrings, and prepares the muscles that are needed to help that person shift and move from one surface to the other. That's a good morning. And for the second exercise, the pivotal lunge, what would be very good to do in the pivotal lunge is because there is a twisting motion. So you'd want to twist, go down into a lunge, touch the ground here, stretching out the shoulders and the back, and then taking it over to the opposite side. So it's up and over and over. And what that does is prepare your core for twisting motions while moving someone or while assisting someone to stand and transfer from one surface to another. Hello, this has been Andre Farnell, fitness mindset coach and master trainer at betterbodyexpert.com.